For the players, it's just another day at the Breslin. They'll have their roaring Izone behind them the whole game. I was not in the Izone my freshman year. Uh, I, st I joined the Izone my sophomore year, but my freshman year I still went to games, you know, here and there. Hi, Hannah. Of course, there's always time for talk before the game. We're like, we're like, look, it's Jake and Hannah, and then like it showed us. But this isn't the typical Izone fans are used to. This is my first uh, alumni Izone game, so yeah, so excited to be here. Once a year, Michigan State alumni like Alex Sanchez pack the student section for an Izone alumni game. Oh my God, that looks like me shooting. And for some, a trip to the Final Four last year was their last Izone game. So people like Alex could not wait to be back for this one. That was our last game in the Izone was in Minneapolis and we just couldn't wait to come back, you know. So of course uh, we knew about it and just glad to be here, I guess. On a normal day, the Izone is bumping. But today, the crowd has a little bit more energy. I do want to thank uh, the alumni Izone. Uh, they were awesome. The alumni crowd is great. You know, they, these guys they don't get to see a lot of games, so they, they love being here, they want to be here, uh, and they show a lot of energy and support. You know, we got the best fans in the world. When Michigan State began to pull away, well, Alex just couldn't contain himself. Oh, that a baby. Oh! Naturally, he had to do a bit of heckling as well. Hey, number 15, your mom just called, said you suck. Alex's score prediction was closer than the final. We'll say final score, 80 to 73. And he's probably okay with that, because the Spartans walked away with this one, 76 to 56. Michigan State got the win, and Alex went home a happy Spartan. So true. In East Lansing, I'm Sam Britton, Focal Point News.